my friends, my name is Zoe Dufour and I'm the sculptor in residence this season at St. Gaudens National Historical Park. We've modified the residency this year due to the COVID-19 virus and so I'll be working virtually with you for the time being from my home studio in Northern California. Since I can't meet you in person, I just wanted to give you a little bit of my backstory as an artist so you can get to know me a little bit more. Um, I guess for me things really started when I moved to New York City. I was 19 years old and it was 2010 um, and I was going to attend Grand Central Atelier which is this really incredible small school founded by Jacob Collins. I started this school actually thinking I was going to be a painter and then partway through the program just uh, <laughs> completely changed direction and uh, it's in large part due to the teacher I had at the time. His name is Juwang Che and he's just a really phenomenal sculptor and he became my mentor and um, obviously profoundly changed the course of my life. I graduated from Grand Central Atelier in 2014 and then my mentor Che got me my first job at a company called Studio EIS which is a commercial figurative studio based in Brooklyn, New York. They really specialize in historical US figures and I'd say, I don't know, prominent cultural figures of today as well. And I really received a second education there. It was an amazing leg up and a great, you know, learning stage of my professional career. And I'm really grateful for the performance. Um, opportunity I guess I had there. <laughs> um, thanks for bearing with me in this video. I'm not used to talking directly into the camera. Um, I'm really grateful for the opportunity I had to work there and the artist community I found at that company and as well as at Grand Central Atelier. Uh, they're just, you know, phenomenal people and phenomenal artists and there have been a huge support system over my career as a professional uh, sculptor. Um, so in addition to working at Studio EIS or Studio ICE, uh, I was teaching at Grand Central Atelier and also at a small school in Damarest, New Jersey called the Art School at Old Church. I worked freelance for various companies and artists around New York City as well and in the tri-state area. Uh, ultimately, I spent about 10 years uh, going to school, living and working in New York City. And then last year, I moved out to Northern California, and so that's where I've been living and working for about a year now. Um, and I was really excited to find out I received the St. Gaudens residency for 2020. And I realize the circumstances are a little bit unfortunate, but I'm, I'm still really excited about the possible outreach uh, working with you over the internet. And I'm also really excited and grateful just for the support that the residency offers me as an artist, you know, a chance to really delve into my own personal work. Uh, my personal work up to date has really been focused on portraiture, and I'm really interested in combining portraiture with environmental or natural elements and sort of exploring perception and identity with in I guess like our attachment to our material environment and our natural environment and seeing how that shapes us as individuals um, and I'm really I'm just ex really can't say how excited and grateful I am for the chance to further my own personal work with this residency so, um, nice to meet you all, and thank you for following along with me virtually in my St. Gaudens residency this year. I'm hoping to get to know you all better over the course of the season.